previously on Realize TV. What's wrong with this teal car? Look at this thing, it's in the air. And the steering wheel. Really like it. Why is it like that? Is there a rack back? I think the rack. Dude, it's like really stiff. It's almost as if it's on the floor. My car is probably on fire. Fire! Fire! Bro, Teddy, what the f just happened? What happened? Dude, my car caught fire. Jason, why doesn't my car work? Let's ignore the fact that my car caught fire. Other than that, nothing has changed. After the fire, did you replace that hose? No. Can you guys believe Final Bout is just around the corner? I feel like we just got back from yeah. US Air. I haven't recovered from the last Final Bout. I was <laughs> broke before Final Bout. I was broke during Final Bout. I am still broke. And we're talking about Final Bout 2, not even <laughs> 3. Why do they do this to us? They just keep coming out with these events. But at least this time, they're going to come out to us. So, you know, that's, can, that's kind of fair, right? Yeah. It's like on our home turf now. Yeah, I know, so we have to drive well. <laughs> Not a chance, especially if you're driving, Teddy. Wow. Are any of our cars even ready? Uh, Mine is still in pieces from Circuit Spirit. Oh my god. I think my car's okay. Because I swapped the rack. Is it good now? I think it's okay. Wait, what was up with that rack? Why was it like that? It was bent. It was really oh. bad. Yeah. You can't drive how you drive in FR Legends. <laughs> Because you just drive across <laughs> the Straight track. Through. Oh Not my how god. You do it. Dude, FR confused. Legends, Gary literally just takes his car over the berms yeah. and jumps it into <laughs> yeah. the desert. Yeah. Dude, so here's the thing is my car still has fire damage from September. Wait, from oh, the oh, oh, from the Hoonigan event? No. Well, okay, that's where it started and then it caught on fire at oh, LSD I and then I parked it with all the fire extinguisher residue still on it. And I haven't seen the car since September. Damn. Show us how you eat that truck. I can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> like morally, I just can't do it. <laughs> I'm already gagging. Well, Chuck ditched us. Did he? Oh, sh. <laughs> yeah, he's gone. I, did, I actually didn't know this. What a quitter. Um. I think we should go back and get my car running. All right, maybe we should get started. Okay, maybe let's get started. But first, coffee. Coffee? I thought Gary said coffee, not horchata, but I mean, who's complaining? I'm not. I know you're not complaining. Not at all. Hor I've never been here. Horchateria. Yeah. Wow. Typical. Horchata coffee. Daily dose, brother. Wow, what, what is it? Is it just horchata coffee or what are they? It's a horchata plus a frappe. Yeah. Jay, you should get this place to sponsor you. They should do that. I want to see a giant horchataria sticker on the side of your car. They could cater to the track. And oh, and then our teal crazy. palace has the horchateria inside. Dude, that'd be so wow. tight. That would be popping, dude. Hey, if any of your family wants to, you know, sponsor us with a horchata at the track, let us know. At horchateria. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm confused. I thought we came to work on this. Oh, well, you guys came to work on that because I'm working on this. What, Jay, did you hear that? Hmm? Gary only brought us here so that we can do the work on his car? Yeah, there's the jack right there. Um, the car's right there. 
Get to work. I'm going home. Here you go. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do with that. All right, Jay. Huh? Better get to it. Step one complete. Jay, what are you doing? Watching Facebook. Dude, you put the car on Jack Sands, now you're done? Now it's Chuck's turn. Then after that, Chuck's, it's your turn. Chuck's not even here. He's coming. This is an ASR. I don't know how the power steering works on this thing. What's going on? You almost done? Nope. I have no clue what's going on. It's a Jay Z. What? The rack is still S13. Here, let me show you what's up. Cabron, what you mean? Oh, I, I can't fit. Hey, Jay, you have to go this way. I'll meet you on the other side. Are we changing the whole rack? No, I already did that part. That's all done. Oh. I just have to tighten one line. One line, Jay? We could have been done with this hours ago. Uh, this one. To tighten this one. Yeah. See how this is sense. in the way. Yes. So this has to come out. Yeah. Tighten this one, reclock it because it's pointing the wrong direction. And then you can put that one back on. That's it. And I have the wrenches for it and everything. I have the proper tools, not like a teddy shop one. You know, you can use like, like romaine lettuce to, to tighten bolts. <laughs> what? 25 years of grime on that. Oh, if you were a good friend, you'd clean that off for him. No, thanks. Look who decided to come back. I always come calling back. Where's our big gulps? I'll give you a big gulp. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? I'll give you a big gulp. Yeah, you're going to give me a big gulp? Yeah. Why don't you get your butt in here and help us work on Gary's car? I actually thought uh, I saw you guys on FR Legends. No. Tandeming. No, no, that wasn't us. I'm pretty sure. No, that wasn't us. We you sure? We've actually been working on this the entire time. I should have stayed fishing. I caught this big I don't tilapia. believe it. I don't believe you caught that. Yeah. Would you have a picture? I do. Look at that thing. That is the most photoshopped photo I think I've ever seen in you my life. You think that's fake? Yeah. I hate working on cars. I hate working on cars underneath the car. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Got Jay doing all the hard work. Over here. In his natural habitat. What the f*** is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Me, Gary, and Jay are starting a new team. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And what is your team going to be called, wise it's guy? It's going to be called Car Shop Notice. Car Shop? Hey, that's actually kind of tight. Let's call it Car Shop Notice Me Senpai. I'm struggling on trying not to get power steering all over me. You don't need help, do you? Man, Jay, if only there was someone around here that could help you. Like a teammate or something. <laughs> <laughs> Worthless, dude. Why'd you even come back? Because I want to at least be a part of it. You're not a part of anything. You're just sitting over there. Did you fill that thing to the top? Yeah, Gary. Oh my god. Jay, what did you do? I kicked it with my butt. <laughs> I was doing good too. Oh my god, dude. That is a pool. That is a literal pool. Well, I have a pool in the shop right now. The blue one. The blue one closer over there. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, that's scary. Like anything more than that's gonna strip. I think it's good. Yeah. Hopefully. Well, let's just turn it on and start right now. There's no power string in it. Does it leak? I mean, I'm sure there's not enough power string. Done? No leaks? Maybe we should go test it because oh. 
the first thing you do after installing or fixing a car is you have to test drive it. That's correct. We should test drive it. Gary, we're gonna test drive your car. What? Right. Yeah, I think he said he yes. He said yes. Yes. He right, said cool. what? Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. That's fine. Right, let's go. Cool. Let's go. Alright, let's go. Get in! I'm waiting for you! Wow. I don't maybe it's always felt like this, but his his rack feels it's smooth, but it's like sticky still a little bit. Interesting. But it's working. I mean, that's always a good thing. Yeah. Okay, so now we're on the closed course, finally. And uh, we're gonna test if the power steering works. Because you don't want to find out at track that the fix that you did at home is no good. Of course not. Must test before you get to track. Absolutely, that is vital. And that's what we're doing right now with not my car, but Gary's. Right. All right. It worked nicely. It steered enough to make it through a track day, I think. Yes. You never know with the teal curse. No. But for now, I think it's enough. I think I think it was pretty decent. Yeah. 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 Sounds like you're uh, ready for final bout now, Gary. Am I? I I don't know. Maybe. Is it good? Yeah. So we tested a little bit. Okay. I think it worked. You took it around the block slowly just to make sure. Block, yeah. Did a couple U turns. Yeah. It's great. Okay. Yeah. Good. Should we uh, go see what's up with my car now? That's gonna be like three episodes worth of crap. <laughs> oh my God. Let's go to your shop. Then. All right. Let's go right now. Right. Let's go. Put it there. God, so weak. You're recording that? Are you kidding? What? You can't pick up your own garage in one shot. Have you ever tried lifting this door? It's like 500 pounds. Are you ready to get this thing running? I'm ready to watch you try. Sorry, why is my car so dusty? Because you haven't been driving it at all and you haven't done anything to it. What is that? Do you have a pet in here? What do you mean? Dude, what those aren't that? cat trails. Debris. Pretty that, like, sure fell. that's Mickey Mouse that was trying to do some pull-ups on your Mouse. roof wing. Look at that. He he made it up though, because you can see all the trail. Dude, pretty sure that's a rat. In I don't. Here. I don't think we should. I don't, we don't need to show that. Look at that, Josh. He was 24-hour fitnessing on your roof wing. We should see if it starts. We should see if it starts. Why? What could have possibly happened? I heard that some harnesses are made from soy and they chew through the harness. That would just be an amazing turn of events if I parked my car here and then a rat chews through my wire harness. What could this possibly mean? I'm going home. Click it again. <laughs> <laughs> One more time. Why, Chuck? I know why. Why? I know why. Why? A teal curse. No. Oh, don't say it. Mix with the rodent. No, the teal curse is the rodent. That sounds horrible. That sounds absolutely terrible. Jesus. All right, Chuck. Now what? It's time to get this car final bout ready. Man, that sounds like a lot of work. Because it's currently still flammable, correct? It is currently still flammable. But you know what? We actually have a solution today for this. A fire extinguisher? <laughs> <laughs> Why? 
So I made a video months ago talking about changing the turbo. Okay. My car, right? Because mm -hmm. it seems like the turbo is the root of all problems, right? The turbo is probably what made the car catch fire. That's been your problem since day since one. Since day one. Day one. But you've been just band-aiding it because you're just a band-aid type of guy. Today, what? we've got a new turbo. What is that? It's bigger than your head. Is it? Is it though, Chuck? It probably is. It? Is. is it? It actually is. Better looking too. So, so this is a Garrett GT 3670-30. So this is a Garrett GT 3076-R. So oh. this, hopefully, A, is not gonna catch on fire. B, is not gonna, is not gonna It's not gonna what? It's not it's gonna, not gonna what, what, Teddy? It's not gonna it's what? Not gonna it's what? not gonna what? Who invited this kid? Jay just appeared out of nowhere. Seriously, dude. <laughs> ruining everything. <laughs> anyway, the thing is that it's gonna solve, it's gonna solve all my problems. You don't know. Right. Oh. Except for the problem between the steering wheel and the seat. Dude, have you, <laughs> dude, this is like beyond quick detailer, man. Look at the, look at all the, the fire extinguisher. You don't know That's what you're doing. You honestly have no idea what you're doing. This is horrible. In life, in general. At least you know it's horrible. Where do I even start? How's it look in there? Well, oh, there's actually nothing, Shefley. Man, what a POS. I can't wait to get rid of this thing. Oh! Are you talking about yourself? Sniff it. Whoa! What is that? Are you guys excited? I'm excited. I don't Shut know up. Just please, hurry. This is called efficiency, you see? Because now the whole... Whole, the whole ha! The whole more. Shut up, dude. You don't think I already know that? Hey, do you really not have a Dude, at this point, we're literally halfway done. Uh, next, I guess the turbo drain line. Oh man, you're like that meme where that girl has a press wrench to the wheel. Level. What am I supposed to do? Look at the size. It's like AN12. Who is? There, there's who. There he is. <laughs> Look who it is, look who it is. Welcome oh, to uh, MTV thing. Paint My Ride. Uh, this is my 1993 D31 300 ZX. Are you kidding me? This is MTV LKQ edition, man. You're kidding me? <laughs> what hatch is that? Who made that hatch? Uh, this was handmade, buddy. It looks homemade. It is homemade. <laughs> How do you drive this thing so low? What do you mean? It practically drives itself. Didn't you bust an oil pan the other day? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. That's definitely not oil. <laughs> What's in the interior of this? I heard you have two throttles, according to Chuck. I do have two throttles. This. What? Zokusha style. What is that? Is that? Bike handle. What? You put a motorcycle handle in your car? I did. Uh, but I also have this nifty horn. Get it to... Wow, Billy, you never cease to impress me. You look like such a doofus. <laughs> Anyway, Chuck, I think we have work to do, man. You have work to do. No, I think we have work okay, as, a so. right, as a team. As a team. Let's pull this turbo off, team? man. Come on, here. Man, the oil return line is just like charred. I can't believe you're still working on this. We only started five minutes ago. No, in the video it's probably only been five minutes. Exactly, so that's the time we'll go by. Dude, look at your nuts. They're all loose. The four bolt. You see that? <laughs> Let me see this camera. <laughs> What, what, Chuck? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm listening here. Looks like a garter snake. <laughs> <laughs> Look, lefty Lucy, right? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's really funny because it's actually not getting any loose or... Oh, mi minimal, minimal spillage. Okay, all right. All right, phase two complete. Chuck, do you even know how excited I am to get rid of this turbo finally? Look at, I have not loosened any of these yet. Do you think that could be a cause of some problems? Um, 
I think that would have caused you problems down the line, but that's not why your car has no power. Chuck, I really love working on cars. I know you do. There's nothing in this world that makes me happier than working on cars. How, how much time do I final about? Can I just do this a different day? Less than two months. Quite, well, no, there's one more, but it's like blocked by everything. I'm getting tired, Chuck. Still. You want to take over? No. I want you to be able to do the honors. <sighs> oh my god, it's almost out. Oh wow. Hey, don't do that. Your manifold's still gotta be alive. Come on, man. It's a China manifold, so it might break. It's not the China manifold, dude. This is genuine. OBX, yeah. XO2. Cool. Oh, how easy was that? Oh. Look at that. Wait. Oh, dude! <laughs> he said, wait! <laughs> I think we found where the fire came from. There's the oil return line. Wow, no, that's, oh. a, uh, oil that's the oil drain? Yeah, that's why I call fire. It's and now it's oh. draining. You want to zoom in and get a close, the get a close up on that? All right, so there's the problem. It's oh. draining onto the manifold. It literally, this is supposed to have an AN fitting pushed into it. Oh yeah, dude, it's all fused. Look at this thing. Oh wow. Wow. Dude, Where look at it. Go, I wonder. No, the well, fitting is still on the there. turbo. That's the thing, and I was telling Jay to wait because it was still attached oh. to the return line when clearly it is not. Get the thing is down. that the line expanded so much it, was, it, it, it just came loose. It got hot and expanded. Even with the heat blanket. Uh, well, I mean you also Yeah. Good job. Teddy built. <laughs> Well, so why don't we make phase four cleaning up the yes. engine bay? And let's do that right now. Should we push it out a little bit? Do you have some degreaser? Uh, I don't know if I have... Yeah, I have simple green, yeah. That okay, that's perfect. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> Man, I love how you're just getting water, like, everywhere. Well, I mean, the struggle of having a shop with no running water. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're doing pretty good. Hey, make sure you get it all over my hands, too. Okay, you got yeah. it. How's it going? Dude, it's going. So good. You know, it's like having a little bit of closure now that I know what caused the fire. It's like, nice, it's no longer like a mystery. Like, yeah. we have very clearly determined what the problem was. Yeah, I see a common theme whenever we're working on stuff. Mm -hmm. So, who's here right now? You, me. Over there. Yeah. What are you doing? Taking a break! What do you mean? A break? You haven't even done anything all day! Alright. Well, so we cleaned all the extinguisher residue off. I mean, looks a lot better now. Kind of. <laughs> yeah. There's still some left, and we still have our sh sh crappy uh, <laughs> return line. We just want to see but, if the turbo will actually right. mount up, right? So, luckily, the flange and everything remains the same, so. And you just gotta kind of re clock the inlet. Either, yeah, either we reclock this or run like a 45, cut yeah. this and run like a 45. A little budget realized build. I mean, dude, final bout is only like four weeks away. Yeah. So, you know, right. at this point, it's like, we right. gotta do what we gotta yeah, do. Right. Or you can cut it and use JB welded to weld it back on. Today, the goal is to get this mocked up and see what we needed. So I think. And now we know what we need. And we know got what all we the need. fittings down, right? And Yeah, so I think Jay's gonna run to Earl's and grab some fittings. Earl's. Rolls. All right. Well, I mean, I guess this is this is kind of as far as we can get for tonight. We don't have we don't have any of the other parts that we need. So, all right, guys. All right, guys. Well <laughs> now you don't want to talk. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Well, we've gotten about as far as we can for tonight on this car. It's going to yep. be crunch time. Final bout happening in the next four or five weeks, I think. And this car obviously has a lot of work cut out for it. Still got both of your cars work. Gary's car is mostly done. All right guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, you guys know the drill, make sure to smash that thumbs up button down below. If you guys wanna check out more of our other episodes as well as upcoming Final About Prep videos, make sure to smash that subscribe button, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Peace. Peace.